once you actually go into Windows, okay, once you actually go into Windows and open up your CPU Z and our CPU frequency is actually 3.45 gig, okay, 3.45 gig, and since you are not satisfying with these results, no. Once the CPU loading actually goes up, you are going to you are actually going to see the true performance of it, right? Okay. Now let's go into auto tuning. Okay. Go into auto tuning. Fast tuning will actually give you the exact same result as what you actually get in from okay from the Turbo Key Two. All right. Extreme tuning is basically Turbo Key Two plus Cosmic tuning. All right. Cosmic tuning is basically tuning. Step by step tuning from where you actually where you actually are now, all right. And extreme tuning is basically a combination of these two together, so it's the one in the middle, all right. And here I think I'll just use extreme tuning, all right. That will be easier, all right. All right. Once you actually hit extreme tuning, because it's going to load the profile first, it will actually restart system, all right. And that's restart the system, and you will actually drop. You actually jump out with the first message saying, "All right, are you satisfying with this result? If yes, quit. If not, wait for one minute, and you will start the actual tuning. Okay, and let's see how much you can actually go with your current configuration. All right? Please do note that the the overall result you can actually you can possibly achieve on this combination is related to how good your fan is. All right? I'm actually using a very very standard fan here." All right, without using any heat cooling paste or anything. So the result will actually not going to be as far as the 30% that we actually claiming. However, all right, once you actually have a better cooling, beyond 30%, it's a piece of cake, okay? Depending on what sort of cooling device you actually have. Water cooling will be very extreme, right? Yes, water cooling or air wind tool or whatever you feel like to use, okay? I do see some users on the web, they are actually using like, you know, homemade, Okay, they're actually using homemade cooling devices out of the air condition. Alright. Uh, so basically, Turbo Key 2 is going to give you an 8% increase on this CPU, of course, on the 555 CPU. Alright, and then we wait for about what, roughly one minute, and let's see what it can actually bring us to. We do actually have a stress test organ inside here. Alright, so basically it means that, like, you know, you will actually go through a series of stress tests and if the stress test is actually pro proving that the system is not stable, you will not use that setting. So there's no risk of the users accidentally frying the CPU? No. Or... Once, you actually, once you actually heat a particular CPU temperature, all right? once you actually heat a particular CPU temperature, it will not accept that value as well because it's, it believes that your cooler is not good enough. So of course, it will actually drop down as well. And in performance wise, because we already unlocked the codes, okay, performance wise, you have to actually double. 18%, yeah. 18% to 36%. Oh, yes. Because it's two You codes. can multiply that by two. Yes. And plus the 100. The base. Yes. Right. Plus the base 100. All right. So once the system hang, there's no worries. Okay, system is going to recover by itself. Because he knows that this is not a, this is not a stable figure. You actually go back to the previous figure and say, alright, your system is only being able to go up to 15%, so 15% is all you are actually going to get on your system. Right. All right so we are at 130% of the original. Yes. Yeah.